In the next few lessons, we will consider stability in the specific case of two-dimensional linear systems. Two equations, two unknowns. We'll start somewhat arbitrarily with the so-called saddle point which are a form of unstable fixed point. So consider this system of linear equations. This system has a fixed point at the origin, which we'll now look at. Assuming that none of the eigenvalues are zero, this is the only fixed point. We'll make this assumption and consider its stability. Suppose that the matrix associated with this system has a two real distinct eigenvalues, one of which is positive, the other is negative. And we're looking at this fixed point at the origin. Then it has two distinct eigenvectors. One for each eigenvalue. Let's extend these eigenvectors into lines. So this is the eigenvector corresponding to a positive eigenvalue. This is the eigenvector associated with a negative. Eigenvalue. These eigenvectors, together with these eigenvalues, largely control the behavior of the system. The first thing to observe is that an initial value on an eigenvector stays on an eigenvector. If we start on this line, we never leave it. And likewise for this one. The second important thing is that the eigenvalue associated with the eigenvector controls what happens on that eigenvector. If the eigenvalue is negative, then we move along the eigenvector towards the origin. 
if the eigenvalue is positive, we move along the eigenvector away from the origin. So if we happen to be on an eigenvector, we know what happens. You go in towards the origin on this eigenvector. You go away from the origin on this one. What if we start near this eigenvector, but not on it? Well, initially, you're sort of pulled along by the negative eigenvalue. But when you get near this eigenvector, you get pulled along by it, away from the origin. So our trajectory looks like this. Likewise, for other initial conditions. This fixed point is called a saddle. And it is a type of unstable fixed point. Now, if you remember our informal definition of instability, where we said that points near a fixed point go away from the fixed point, you might ask, what about points on this eigenvector? They don't go away from the fixed point, which is true. What's also true is that this line is a one-dimensional object in two-dimensional space. It has literally no area. There is a 0% chance that you start on it, and if you somehow did start on it, the random perturbations inherent to any real world system would immediately kick you off it. So we don't call this semi-stable or anything like that. It's just unstable. In this video, we have looked at one type of a fixed point called a saddle point. In a two-dimensional space, we have a limited number of possibilities. We either have two real eigenvalues, one real eigenvalue, or two complex eigenvalues. These cases break into subcases, but not so many that we can't consider all of them.
The only case we're going to ignore is the case where one of the eigenvalues is zero. And we'll see why later.